Hi guys, today we're going to be showing you how to make dosa. This is a very simple, very delicious uh, flatbread that we make. This is a South Indian dish. Uh, we're also going to be showing you how to make the masala for the dosa, but that's in the next recipe. For the dosa, we're going to need half a cup of urid dal, one and a half cups of basmati rice. So for every one part dal, we have three pots rice. We've soaked the rice and the dal overnight, and now we're going to blend it or grind it in our magic bullet. We're only going to use as much water as required to turn the lentils or the dal into a very fine paste. So once you're done blending it, a good indication of it being ready blended enough is that it will look very foamy, as you can see, and it will have no solid grains in it. We'll empty out the container into our mixing bowl and we will blend or grind the lentils in sections, in parts, so that we can blend it all quite easily. This is what it should look like. As I said before, it is looking quite foamy. Now we're going to do our rice. And once again, we're only going to use a very small amount of water, just enough to actually blend all the rice into a fine paste as well. However, because it is rice, um, it will be a little bit grainy. And there's no need to make the rice as smooth as the lentils. It's okay if it remains a little bit grainy. And we're going to mix it in with the lentils and then we're going to leave it overnight to ferment. So our process has taken about 24 hours before we cook. We soaked the rice and the lentils overnight. We ground it the following morning and now we're going to leave it through the day and we will cook it at night. So 24 hours in total. And we're going to add about half a teaspoon of salt and we will mix it in well. So this is our dosa mixture and it's ready. These are the utensils we will need. So we'll need just a little bit of cooking oil, a ladle, um, a spatula and a brush. So we've warmed up our frying pan and we're going to remove it off the heat and then we will pour one scoop of the dosa mixture onto our pan and spread it out as you can see. So the dosa that we're making today should be quite thin. And we've made that by rolling out the ladle on top of the mixture and flattening it out. Uh, we're going to put the pan back onto the heat and once it starts to bubble and it is cooked on top as well because we won't be flipping the dosa over, once the thin parts of the dosa start to become a little bit brown, we will brush some oil onto the dosa. And we will allow it to cook until the brown becomes a little bit more prominent in the clear parts as you can see now. And we will roll it up. And it's a nice golden brown on the outside. And our dosa is now ready. We hope you've enjoyed watching this recipe. But just cooking is also available on Facebook for any questions or comments you may have. Give it a try. Good luck. Let us know how you go. And thanks for watching.